I know what you're thinking, and I agree. It's time for a hair wash. If you haven't been for a hair wash in Taiwan, let me put it to you this way. It is one of my absolute most favorite things to do in Taiwan. And it's not a chick thing, it's a pampering thing. In fact, I know more guys that go for hair washes than girls. So right off the bat, I'm sitting down, turning on the TV, and a girl comes over and she gives me anywhere between a 15 to 20 minute back rub and shoulder massage. This is a standard operating procedure at most salons, but to be safe, just ask before you sit down that this massage is included in your wash. I'm still sitting in the chair and at this point I'm just going to take out my earrings and she's going to come back with a little bottle of lukewarm water and some shampoo and she's going to wash my hair right here in the seat. I don't have to move at all. I don't want to color or cut or anything today, I just want to wash and dry and for that I'm going to say while she's washing my hair, I'm also getting a little bit more pampering on my back of my neck. Now we're done with the washing and we're going to the basin to rinse off. And what you can't see in this clip is that the chair that I'm lying on is actually vibrating as well. So an additional little pampering. Sometimes when they rinse off your hair, they drag their fingers through your hair quite harshly. It breaks my hair, so I'm going to say So she's not going to drag her fingers through my hair. Most salons are going to give you some very basic conditioner at this point. My hair is quite dry, so I'm going to pay a little bit more and I'm going to get a fast treatment, which is just a really strong conditioner. And I'm going to pay an extra 100 NT for that. I'm also getting some nice hot towels as part of my Kwai Su Hu Fa. So I've done the treatment now and I'm back in the chair, hot towel on the neck, a little bit more pampering. So now Angel, the hairstylist, is coming over. She's going to dry my hair a little bit and then she's going to ask me how I want to style my hair. You have some options. Included in your wash is just a basic straight blow dry or you can blow dry a little bit wavy or curly if you like. I'm going to pay a little bit extra today because um, I want to put curlers in my hair. Uh, to put curlers in my hair, I'm going to say Sang Juan Zi and I'm going to pay an additional 50 NT for that. Alternatively, you can also straighten your hair with a straightening iron which is also going to cost you approximately 50 NT. Every salon is different in pricing so you might want to ask before you add anything. So now my hair is dry, curlers are coming out, um, having a nice chat with Angel and um, I am a local at the salon and I'm also a member at the salon I've been coming here for many many years so Angel knows how I like to do my hair so she's gonna straighten the top bits a little bit to get rid of the extra little frizzy bits I'm gonna add a couple of notes to this post on my blog just to um, to help you navigate if you need it in Chinese English and in Pinyin so I'm about done here and I'm a member at the salon so I'm not going to pay that much. I'm only going to pay 280 today. But even if you go without being a member, I wouldn't expect you to pay much more than 180 to 200 depending on the length of your hair. If you add the straightener or the curls, you're going to pay a little bit more, maybe up to 300. Just absolute fantastic value, two hours of pampering and nice fancy hair.